Right, uh, hello all, and welcome back again. Uh, this is Arch Linux, uh, XFCE4 desktop, and I'm proud to present a uh, nice conky script written by uh, Rookie Linux. Uh, that's his uh, YouTube channel name. And it's been nice enough to send me a very nice script with the fonts and the icons and everything. And I'll try to step through it, um, but there's a lot of uh, variables and things that I don't quite get yet, <laughs> and some of them uh, uh, you have to. Well, there's there's a few things you have to do to customize it for your own system. So first of all, I'd like to um, talk about the Nvidia. If you're using the Nvidia card, you see that if you have a thermal setting uh, set through a Zorg variable, uh, you can enable GPU fan speed set to 20. As you can see here, I'll zoom in. It's not set, it's just on its own, and you see the temperature's going up as I'm recording. So I'm gonna launch the script. Um, I'm gonna, there's two, there's a bunch of ways um, to launch the entire thing is, uh, you can have a uh, shortcut on your desktop or in your start menu uh, through the terminal or through a keyboard shortcut. So I'm just gonna run the script because there's a few, um, they're not errors of just, uh, especially with, you'll see. It's more to do with uh, the uh, GTK theme. So it's running, and now it's uh, set the attribute GPU target speed to 20. And that takes a bit to kick in. And there is a uh, sleep time variable on this, okay? Um, most of the warnings I see now are um, to do with GTK warnings, but the most one for me on my system since I'm using an AMD is a sys class thermal uh, variable. I don't have that on my system, it's just not there. So I'm just gonna kill this and get back out, okay? And I'm just gonna run it one more time and uh, hopefully. And you can see, there it is. If I go to my NVIDIA settings now and look at the thermal settings, you can see now the fan has been set to 20%. So the temperature is, uh, is going down, as you can see. So the scripts, there's a lot of, uh, like I said, configuration. So I threw it into an archive. And uh, here's the launch conky script. Now you can put this anywhere and make it executable uh, so it just there's the sleep variables just get the state and the GPU target fan speed equals 20 which is percent and then uh, another variable error error variable and then uh, the this part here the the weather okay so that's the launching script if you want you can obviously run these individually so the conky dot conky file and uh, has the script, one script, an LUA script, and a whole bunch of icons, as I mentioned, and it's Conky RC. Uh, there wasn't much I had to change in here, I don't think. Oh yeah, there was. Mm, sorry, there was there was a few things. A couple of things was the if I'm if you're using AMD, there's a couple of two or three uh, AMD logos. And Arch Linux logo, and I changed this to a solid state drive uh, image logo, whatever, and the GeForce SC S970 SC, and uh, you can see now the temperature has gone down and the fan speed. Okay, so if you're familiar with Conkey, you know, um, this shouldn't be too bad to run through. Um, one note is for wireless. Uh, run w i i w config to get uh, your IP and I mean your cards uh, name what would Arch Linux would see it as okay so and just you'll have to experiment a little bit so I'm sorry it's it, it is quite involved now we go to the dot capital C conky HTC home and there's uh, the conky RC again. I tried to get the temperature unit to go to Fahrenheit, but 
it I don't I'm not sure where to change that it, so I threw this in and tried Celsius and Fahrenheit it just didn't seem to work uh, but there isn't much I don't think you have to change here all the fonts are included and the AccuWeather and the script um, all the stuff's included and uh, these will just output onto your screen so the only thing you have to do here really is change go to AccuWeather.com and then uh, just type in where you are and just take this whole area in the, in the quotation marks and replace it with whatever is here okay now the uh, script uh, to run HTT temp uh, you have to download it for Arch Linux I already have and I just run it on demand so sudo system ctl start zoom in hdd temp dot service and give this a second to kick in and you should see the temperatures there on each uh, the ones that I I defined in the original conk ERC the first one not the weather one all right as I said it's a lot <laughs> and back to the LUA file it's probably a different name for that I'm sorry is there's some variables again is your network uh, for the up and down speed right here and so you can look for I think it's a uh, LAN LAN right here so down speed and right there is if you're using a wireless like I said you change it to that and the same thing with your download in between the quotes I think it's ET zero or something by default and for the where am I here I'm trying to remember which one is which for the time you want a 12 hour in the conky RC uh, the weather part it's in the time and uh, clock and date like it's showing you the uh, the day year and so on but this is a 12 hour setting so what I have to do is look for the <laughs> the clock and date and there's uh, different times here right here this is the archive version so I haven't changed it you change this capital H to a capital I and then either stop or let it update itself and it should if you want 12 hour okay so what do we do with all this stuff well it's pretty much as is so they'll be all dot files, okay? So you extract them to your home folder, the dot conky with the capital C, and the other one, dot fonts. Um, I should actually call that fonts because in Arch Linux it's supposed to go into your dot local share um, fonts folder, and there they are there. And they seem to be working because uh, this would have be way out of portion if uh, they weren't. Okay, so local share, and I'll change that actually, and I'll make a note of that. Now, I'd I would love to include this uh, at, in my um, Arch Mid editions, uh, ISO, uh, but uh, as I mentioned to um, Rookie, is we need a front end, maybe a GUI, because I don't want to, you can uh, more confused than I already have already. Um, if we can get something where it's a, like, you know, almost a one click setting or something like that, uh, that I would love to include this. But if I, if, if it is, you know, if I leave it as it is, you could end up with a huge jumbled mess on your desktop and you're going, you know, people will be going, what do I do with this? So I love this script. It's amazing and all the stuff you can do with it so uh, for now I'll just uh, upload the uh, the files and make some adjustments and uh, hopefully if you watch this video you can um, hopefully you can understand what I'm trying to say and make the adjustments for your own system all right so like there isn't add any adverse effects or anything and if you're not using an, uh, an Nvidia card I'm not sure I know there's AMD settings, but I can't remember what they are. All right, so that's uh, uh, Conky by Ricky Linux on YouTube, and I'll leave a link to his uh, channel as well. All right, so that should do it for this one, and thank you so much for watching. We'll talk to you soon, and bye for now.